actually gets to the low single now. All right, not a lot has changed in this position. We get to this low single. Again, outside hand frame in the foot, head on the inside of my knee. I gotta beat this position now so he gets to his low single attack here. All right, first thing I've gotta do is get weight on my doggone foot, okay? Height doesn't win in a scramble, all right? People that say that is just a generic term because they don't kind of understand the whole totality of scrambling. Well, first thing that wins in a scramble is more feet in the mat, okay? So if I got one foot in the mat, he's got two feet in the mat, he's winning the scramble. All right, we've got to understand that. Any wrestling position, it's a battle of feet in the mat. The more feet I have in the mat, the more power I can generate, the more direction I can change, it makes me athletic. I'm not talking about I was born with a lot of athletic ability. What I'm talking about is I can generate power, I can move around if my feet are in the mat. If I got one foot in the mat, I can't change direction near as much as when my feet are in the mat. So you gotta understand that if my feet are connected to the mat, I'm more athletic, period. In every position in wrestling, especially in scrambling. So when we're scrambling, first thing that's going through my head is feet in the mat. Okay, literally feet in the mat. Now he's attacking my lead leg, so it's super important that I get weight on my lead leg. So as soon as he makes contact, knee hits the shoulder. Knee jams into the shoulder, then slides outside of the shoulder. Does everybody see that? I'm jamming his shoulder, then sliding outside. All I want you to do is dive straight over the top once your knee beats his shoulder. So I'm just gonna jam, slide, dive straight over the top, and turn and face him. Okay, I'm turning towards him and facing him. So the minute he makes contact with this low single, jam, weight on my foot. Got a good drive leg, knee slides outside, dive straight over the top. Watch what my chest does. Faces the mat the entire time. It's not a car wheel, it's not some weird spiral, death dive, okay? My chest stays facing the mat, like a superhero flying through the air, and I turn in towards his body, okay? So he low singles, jam, slide, dive, over the top. Notice, feet are back in the mat, I'm athletic, I can wrestle here, okay? That's super important. Step one of winning a scramble, get more feet in the mat, period. Get feet in the mat. Questions? Anybody need to see it again? One more time, all right? Low single, jam, slide, outside the shoulder, Dive straight over the top. Notice my hands hit, then my feet snap, knees snap under me. I don't hit my hip, I don't go to my elbows. Those are positions where I'm not very athletic. Hands hit, knees snap, feet make contact with the mat. Okay, we'll start piecing the rest of this finish together in a minute. Go!